that's on now. We heard... We heard tell of the Emmental Blast. Baldoy is staying in, in Middengarda by his brother uh, wherever after he rises again in the hall in the halls of the gods having gone having gone forefront of the of the Ermansol. Further to his god law, Bal ba Baldoy's uh, Droima tells us that Baldoy suffered from dreams foreshadowing his doom. Free his mother is likewise said to have shared these dreams foretelling her son's doom. North Germanic law holds that Baldor's death is is is, a, uh, is a forewarning of the doom of the gods. Woden rides out to hell to learn of how many how he may stop his son's death. But alas, alas to the gods, we are undone by the trickery of the unnamed one. And in the end, Valdoy is slain again. For his brother, uh, he hath well, he hath well, when he shoots his mistletoe at him. In England, there is a poem, both old and wise, known as the Man by Mitch, in which the man of my rides in search of the nightmare. And upon finding her bones, her with her own hair. To stop the nightmares happening, the rider and binder of the nightmare, he is un understood to be Woden himself. And this links to the god law of Woden in Baldur's, in Baldur's drama, riding off to Han to try and forestall the death of his son. Of his son. Foreseen by Baldi and Free in their nightmares, the man of Mitch is clearly a firm Cedar Galdor, plotted to keep nightmares at bay uh, or forestall what they foretell. Some dreams can foreshadow our weird, and nightmares such as the ones that uh, harassed Baldi and, Fri and Free could have awful ends. Night, he rode at night, with neither sword nor beard nor light. He sought the mare, he found the mare, and he bound the mare with her own hair, and made, the, and made her swear by middle might she would no, no more ride at night. Where once he rode, that man of might. Uh, if everybody uh, could repeat, please. Hail the mono, hail the mononix. Hail the mono, hail the mono. Hail the Night Rider! Hail the Night Rider! Hail Warden! Hail Warden! Great Freeg's God Law, we see her as the leading lady of the gods, a loving mother and steadfast Gideon, fastened to weird. What's so hard, Free? What's so hard, Free? Our Freyo. Our Freyo. Ingui sister. Ingui sister. Woden's wife. Woden's wife. Spaywalk. As we come before you at Yule. As we come before you at Yule. In your name. In your name. Let our homes be blade fest. Let our homes be blade fest. Let our folk be whole. Let our folk be whole. Let our lad be strong. Let our lad be strong. Yael Amorda. Yael Amorda. In your frith. In your frith. We keep. We keep. Seek free frail. Seek free frail. As we prepare for another cycle of the wheel and make our plans. We must remember the weird. Weird is an old English word which means what has become and what has happened. It is the unchangeable things 
in the past and in life which may have already happened and which are outside of one's control. Yet hold sway over us. Where is linked with, with worth and the two are bound to one another. Weird is often seen as a well made up of layers of past deeds or as we've been or as we've been spun. Three female hoi ones are said to steward the well by the roots of the ermine soul or to spin its weave. Their names are Weird and Weird and Skill. Together they are known as the Weird Swayer, also known as the Weird Sisters. The spinners and the norns. The sisters are kept strong and whole, but the weird, just as well, of the, just as well of the weird, is kept strong and whole by them. Weird flows from the well, or is woven uh, from the wheel, or through the ermine soul, to all to all worlds and halls. Just as from all, all worlds and halls, the deeds of all living things and their outcomes feed back into the well of weird, adding a layer to it or adding more yarn to the basket. Weird end is, is undying time flows from her to weird as deeds reach their ends, ends and skilled sways the, the be going as deeds in the past sway now. Weird from the past leads uh, leads to uh, inheritance, uh, yeah, inherit inheritance. Sorry, of all lag from our forebears, which shapes the paths we walk. The better the inherited all lag, the better the magen. The ha one has one has for themselves and bestow on two others. Weird is our water flowing through under and over things, an irresistible force which can throw forward and backward. Old deeds impact on new folk, but new folk make the deeds which impact those yet to be. In Tolkien's The Fellowship of the Ring, Gandalf scorns Frodo to thinking that Gollum is better off dead. Gandalf says, true courage is about knowing not when to take a life, but when to spare one. Uh, further back in time to the Hobbit, Bilbo, Frodo's older, well, older uncle, it's his cousin, but he's actually uh, his uncle, uh, spares Gollum's life when it would have been easy to take it. While unseen, the wearing in the ring, Bilbo's unbeckonest uh, uh, to him at the time, saves his, saves his, uh, saves his uh, nephew's life. Years later, as Gollum inadvertently destroys the ring by losing his footing and falling into the lava. After wrestling it back from Frodo, whose steadfastness had buckled at mates. Doom and so freed Frodo from its grasp. Tolkien was a professor of Old English and his stories drew heavily from the Anglo-Saxon North. Germanic lore. The story shows that Weird is an in, interest, intricate weave woven with many strands in the past fundamentally, holding sway over the now and the yet to be. Weird end is undying time, flows from her weird as deeds reach their ends, and skilled sway this be going as deeds in the past sway the now. From the Anglo-Saxon poem, The Wanderer, comes, comes the line, Weird Biff Bull Arad, meaning weird is steadfast, and from Beowulf comes the line, uh, Glide a weird swa heel skel, meaning weird goes over uh, as she shall. The English belief of weird is that which has, has come come before that which is coming and that which will come. Weird overlies every bit of Middengadda and the other worlds. We each of us here have a weird and indeed all things from, from the Durkin to the gods are bound by the weird. Weird is that which, which is everyone dying 
and undying. She goes as she must, steadfast and true. It is said that when we are born, the spinners cut the thread of weave, which is our lifespan. So they know then that birth, when we will meet our death. With the winter, instead, we are at time when sinner's light is at lowest. Where death abounds, the wolves give, give chase, and the Harry, the Welkin rider, yet weird, is steadfast. This is yearly tide, and our Germanic time is uh, silico. Just like Sunna, who continues to ride, just like Beowulf, uh, who fought the worm alone, having been abandoned by his fellows, and just like Deor, who, when suffering hardship, said throughout it all that we went away so many, this we each of us must have and thank for our weird. In, in uh, Fanes of Fern Cida, Anfang is the first of, of our of our, of our nine April woman. It means acceptance for the things you cannot change and, uh, and which fighting uh, against would at worst eat away, eat away at you. And at best, waste your time having Anfang therefore can stop this damage and there is a static strength in Anfang for your weird. For you acknowledge that uh, you are one small piece of a greater puzzle which is not always understood. In the two towers by Tolkien it reads you have not you have not said all that you know or guess. Aragorn, my friend, Gandalf said quietly. Poor Boromir, I could not see what happened to him. It was a sore trial uh, of such a man, a warrior and a lord of men. Gladriel told me that he was in peril, but he escaped in the end. I am glad it was not in vain that the young hobbits came with us for only, for only Boromir's sake. Uh, this passage speaks of weird and Gladriel seemed able to foresee things in much the same way that we can, can also see the weird of men. It can be said that Boromir's weird was sealed and that he was set to, li to lose the battle with the ring as so many others had. Yet after losing this battle and involuntary breaking his fellowship with the hobbits, uh, he chose, he chose to fight stout-heartedly, slaying many orcs and taking many arrows, which ended his life. Gandalf is glad of that which has come to pass, and the fellowship having met in this way. As Boromir died heroically for the fellowship, much like Beowulf, Boromir's death is one truly befitting such an eighth-ling warrior. Our lives are limited and affected by others uh, around us and those, those before us as well. As the steads we live in all age to help us from the path in front of us. And the Megan we raise, uh, how, we walk, how we walk it. Yet there is still the free will within us that can sway things and which is no doubt itself affected by Megan it was Anfang for this weird to let Boromir die a warrior's death and let him die having won back his honour, leaving behind great mercy. Weird is steadfast, weird goes ever as shall shall as she shall. Weird winter, death fights, not against these unbreakable fetters, instead hold the true fellowship, laugh in the face of the adversity. Small from the downpour, one can never in uh, enjoy, sorry, uh, enjoy the light without darkness, nor merry making without sorrow. And thank fellows, and thank this. Ethel wanna is strength, where well, we cannot break, break all fetters. We can change our attitude towards them. Do so, and, and you will become, become uh, 
Ethel Bourne, Song Frey to Saw with the Greats. Uh, if we could all repeat, repeat please. Weird is steadfast. Weird is steadfast. Weird goes ever as she shall. Weird goes ever as she shall. What's the hell, weird? What's the hell, weird? Swear to. Swear to. Spinners and weavers. Spinners and weavers. Long may you stew at the well of weird. Long may you stew at the well of weird. Whatever befalls me. Whatever befalls me. Like Beowulf. Like Dale. Like Dale. And like the great ones. Like the great ones. I shall have Anfang. I shall have Anfang. Before the end of my weave. Before the end of my weave. Great deeds will I do. Great deeds will I do. Great things for my fellows. Great things for my fellows. Good things for my kin. Good things for my kin. And fame of the fern cedar. And fame of the fern cedar. So doom and so freed. So doom and so freed. Oh, oh wait, no, sorry, that's the next bit. Yeah, oh, oh, from, uh, oh, sorry, Frodo from its grasp. Frodo from its grasp. What's your hell? What's your hell? Tolkien, but, oh, wait, no. So if you could repeat again please. Uh, that's when I go. That's when I go. Four from. My forebears shall welcome me gladly. My forebears shall welcome me gladly. Sega Angle Kid. 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 Okay. Uh, oh, and then there's one more bit. What's what's so hail uh, let us disc? What's so hail let us disc? Ask keep our layout whole. Hail you high ones. Sega Sia. Sega one eye. Sega one ear. What's the hell? So ends uh, that of today's script. I'm going to put that back in the folder and we can, uh, we can begin. That's uh, fine, is it that us? We can begin. Uh, we can begin the. Uh, In the symbol. Yeah, that's fine. Isn't it? That's the one. Thank you for that. I appreciate that. I like that from there. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, camera's still rolling. That's good. Uh, it is time. Oh, Ian, uh, did you want to do uh, your poem, brother? Yeah, okay. yeah that's fine. Right. Sorry, brother. Right. I'm not going to cut it off like they did two years ago. There you go, brother. I'll uh, you stand on it. It's a bit windy, so it won't flap about. Sooner, fires and lights. Ray of sunshine after the night. Her unbridled beauty brings forth the dawn across the skies in chariot drawn. With hair of gold, features so fair, with light to give and warmth to share. Pouring forth her golden rays over Midgard, bearing days. So hail Sunna, goddess, goddess of light, the aura of beauty shining so bright. He's done me about five copies of that, Ian. Uh, did you want to keep hold of it? Or did yeah, yeah, that's fine. No problem, brother. So I've got another copy for next year, if, uh, if you need it. Cousin Denu and uh, little Bjorn uh, to sing Bob's Blimey Yule. By the uh, band
Yol. Bulbaldus Joy Mat. Come and drink and join us and sing of life so free. The light will shine and the leaf will sprout. So come and drink and join us and sing of life so free. Let's us first life of twelve nights time for uh, the toasts, uh, like at the last lot, uh, would you prefer me to cut off the video for the toasts or uh, are you happy to do them on the video? I, I totally respect whatever you guys want to do, if there's anyone that doesn't want to do toasts on the video I can cut it here and now if you wish. Cut it, yeah that's fine you're there. Thank you everybody, I am Yom and Rich Nicholson, uh, myself uh, Fine's but uh, Fine's a fancy day, and we have our brothers and sisters here. 
Thank you for watching back, joining us virtually. Uh, Wassel Hale, see you later. Wassel Hale. Wolf. So I got it, bud.